Hey, this is Russ. You know, it's not my fault. Yeah, it's, it's not really my fault. You know, I told you guys I was going to go on a diet, and uh, that didn't do too well. <laughs> no, it really wasn't my fault. Let, let me tell you some of the reasons why it wasn't my fault, you know. I think I mentioned once before that I, I've been wearing sweatpants now for quite a while. So, <laughs> yeah, since, uh, since my knee replacement. So that would be September 19th, 2019. I've been wearing sweatpants. That's my main pants that I wear, okay? So I needed to wear the sweatpants because, you know, when you're doing physical therapy, um, it's just easier to have something like that on. Uh, or shorts, right? But uh, eventually you you move to the sweatpants. And I've been wearing sweatpants more than anything else, <laughs> right? And um, I, I blame the sweatpants. Yeah, I think I think it was the sweatpants fault because really, if you, if you eat a little bit too much, um, you don't really notice it. <laughs> okay? Yeah, that you know that uh, elastic waistband, you know that that'll give. That'll, that'll move with you. So how are you supposed to know if you're gaining weight or you're not? So I, I blame the sweatpants. I think that's the reason why the, the diet didn't really work too well. Yeah. Um, oh, and I also blame the, the, the challah bread we've been making. Yeah. Yeah. It's, I think it's the bread's fault. Yeah. Because we did that maybe three or four times. Yeah. Yeah, it was the bread's fault. Yeah, May no, maybe it was the butter's fault because you can't can't have bread without the butter. So maybe eating all that butter, maybe that was. Yeah, I think it's the butter's fault. Yeah, yeah, it's got to be that. Yeah, it, was, it wasn't me. I, obviously, it was not my fault. It's never my fault. Oh, and you know, and since we're home all the time, you know, it's so convenient to be able to go to the to the refrigerator and just get something. So, yeah, I think it's the refrigerator's fault because if it wasn't so conveniently located, you know, on the same level of the house as where I, I do my work, okay. Yeah, you know, it's actually the work's fault, the lack of the work. If I had things to do, then I wouldn't be eating so much, right? But, you know, I stopped my photography business and then uh, just started making these YouTube videos. So, really, it wasn't a whole lot there. To do so you know the next thing you know you're eating some stuff yeah no it's actually it's it's youtube's fault you know if i didn't have youtube to make i'd be doing other stuff which means then i i probably wouldn't be eating so much so yeah maybe it's youtube's fault no maybe it's your fault yeah maybe it's you guys you know because you watch my videos and then we have over a thousand subscribers now, so so you make a few extra dollars because of that. Once you hit the one thousand subscriber mark, right? They, you know, then then they give you a few dollars because of the advertising that happens before the videos. So maybe that's the fault. Yeah, yeah, it wasn't what wasn't my fault. Yeah, yeah, I think it's your fault. <laughs> I think it's your fault for watching all this stuff. It's you guys. Yeah, I think it's your fault. It's not my fault. It's never my fault. Yeah. Yeah, it's everybody's fault. It's not my fault. I'm 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 blameless. Russ is always right. <laughs> you buy that? <laughs> Did that work? <laughs> yeah, the diet didn't go too well, but hey, here's one thing I do know. Got to go back on the diet. <laughs> I told you guys that I was going to lose what 20 pounds, 20 25 pounds by end of February. <laughs> Here it is, like middle March, give or take, right? Yeah, it didn't happen. Didn't happen. Actually, ended up gaining. How much did I gain? I'd say I gained between eight to ten pounds now. <laughs> so I am back to the weight that I was before I went to get the knee replacement. You know, after you get the knee replacement, you lose a bunch of weight. You do. A lot of people do. You know, because you lose your appetite and you. Um, you know, things aren't as easily available to you. I mean, you know, when your knee is all messed up and you have to walk to the refrigerator, come on, that's not going to happen. <laughs> You're going to lose some weight, all right? So whatever weight that I had lost, I had gained back, essentially. So uh, so even though I, I gained some, some weight, I'm not over the weight I was before I started the knee replacement. I'm back to the weight I was when 
I got the knee replacement, all right? But I do know I need to, to lose some weight because I do want to get out on the bike sometime this year if I can. <laughs> you look a little better when you're not overweight on the bike, all right? And uh, so overall, I've got to go back on the diet. So I'm not going to give a amount, but I will tell you that I'm going to work on it, all right? Now, let me tell you a, a good thing. My wife took up the, uh, the gauntlet and she said she was going on a diet and she has lost a lot of weight. Yeah, she has. Now, and she was not overweight, all right? So to lose whatever she, she lost, okay, she is, if not at the weight she was when we got married, which was, uh, oh, how long ago was that? <laughs> it's going to be 36 years this uh, summer. Um, she's at least that weight, if not even a tad lower than the weight she was when we got married. And she was a, a fit person. She was not overweight at all. So, so she's back to where she should be. Um, I'm not. So I've got to get the, I got to get cracking. Got to, got to, got to do more stuff and uh, cut down the eating, do a little more exercise, that kind of thing. I, I hate doing exercises, quite frankly. I have enough exercises with the knee stuff. I don't need more exercises to go on top of it, but you need to do it. Now, I was kind of hoping uh, to to be able to do some toning and things um, because, you know, I, I had joined the gym, the local gym, and had to stop because of the pandemic. <laughs> But I was getting in a rhythm there, okay? I was trying to fix my knee, but I could see myself getting onto weights and stuff like that to kind of get me uh, more more toned up. But yeah, I'm not going to be going back to that place anytime soon. I know that. So I've got to come up with ways to do things on my own. Anyways, I just wanted to let you guys know that I'm going to have to go back on the diet. Uh, hopefully, you got a little kick out of the opening of this video. <laughs> yeah, it's never my fault. It's somebody else's fault. I'll talk to you guys next time.